Okay, here we go. Turn some AC on. It is hot here in Texas. Yeah, that blows nice and cold. You know, I'd never driven one of these until this one, and it's it's pretty impressive. It's a, in fact, it's very impressive it, in terms of drivability. It's a big old lumbering machine that can do so much more than just, well, any other vehicle ever built, is what they say. But at the same time, it's very, very drivable. Very impressive. These towing mirrors allow you to really keep up with what's going on all around you. I love those. Okay, when we get out on the uh, road here where we can go highway speeds, I'll give it a little diesel fuel, and you'll see this thing, I think it's a rocket for what it is. It's very impressive, great power. You know, the thing that surprised me most about this vehicle is the power. It's got incredible torque. I mean, this big giant will not only keep up with traffic, it'll, it'll outrun traffic. It's got some amazing power. That surprised me. I, I, I did not expect that. It has a special tune of some sort, and this little apparatus right here that allows you to keep up with everything that's going on. You know, the fellow that outfitted this excursion uh, knew what he was doing. He added some, some nice additions that make it a much more flexible, much more usable vehicle. And uh, looks cool, looks real cool. Okay, let's let this thing breathe a little bit. Wow. Wow. So we easily overtake the traffic. Oh my gosh, this thing, <clears throat> this thing will go. Okay, let's see, that's uh, 70 miles per hour right there. It's actually pretty smooth. I mean, I think that accelerates better than my cars that I have. That's, that's real impressive. I had no idea these things ran like this. Maybe this one's faster than the normal one, I don't know. But just in regular driving, you can't tell it's anything other than a purring pussycat. Because um, it does purr, those diesels purr. But man alive, does it run. It looks fantastic. I mean, it's got eyeball, a lot of eyeball, without a doubt. 